poet. Say it again. I'm not a fucking liar. I'm a poet. (laughs) Poets aren't fucking liars, for Christ's sakes. They're too fucking crazy. They can't tell the fucking devils. He's lying. He's lying. He's lying. No, no. I was at the On Ross Island Bridge, on the way there, there's there's, um, (laughs) Union Hall. Right. And he spoke there. John F. Kennedy, you're saying? No, no Bobby Kennedy. Bobby. This is right before oh, yeah. he died, right? Bobby, that's just the week before he died? No, I know, but no, I was with Bobby. I was with Bobby, really? too. Right? Come on, I know I was with Bobby. I thought first he was name just in your dream. All these first name babies. <laughs> <laughs> back, but I- it's interesting you said that because that's the one on the next page. Read it. Sorry. You ready for this? Ready, well, probably. <laughs> it's called The Infrangible Informant. No, 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 no. This is the one that has dope in it. It's the only goddamn one. No, it's the one about the, the guy in the print. Why don't you let him read it, Walt? He knows what he's read, doing. Let us consider for half a minute a car whose windshield is frozen over. I know that I have consumed nitrous oxide, <laughs> entered the vehicle in swimming trunks, <laughs> then wandered aimlessly for what seemed days until just the right green light went on. (laughs) Now this. The process of waking up screaming also sometimes occurs during our conscious hours, which makes us feel like an atheist who is all dressed up at his own funeral, but has no place to go. That's why we must socialize more discreetly becoming so sensitive at last to danger signs that we neglect to spot our own. I ramble. No. But there is a moral here somewhere, one so obvious to everyone I start to cry. Beautiful. Oh, oh, this one, Marty, I want this so one, though. Beautiful. No, oh, no don't do the one about the, they were smoking dope. Oh, Marty, I love Go ahead, do it. This is not necessarily about dope. Well, I think it is. That's one interpretation. Okay, go ahead. A cautionary tale. Oh, you're going to love this. On this 37th birthday. 68th birthday. A person like myself who has almost no goddamn criminal record. Uh, Oh, don't get it. Well, you know, I'm thinking of calling my next book expunged. Why don't you dedicate to this to Marjorie? No, 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 go ahead and read it. Marty, Because I've already published a goddamn book, that's why. <laughs> finish the poem. Come on. Don't fuck around with it. Read it. Her virgin soul had been an orchid of the spirit. Now she was getting older and had begun to fear it. One night, the swan of paradise swam by and watched her through a sad, abandoned eye. She sneezed into the bread what she was needing, and she tried to hide the book that she was reading. On a dim night, the purple clown appeared. She took him to her room and disappeared. They ate up all the bread she had been needing. And they discussed the book, what she was reading. <laughs> Another night, the swan of paradise swam by and watched them in the kitchen getting high. <laughs> That's all I can tell you in this moral tale, except the Spencer and the clown both went to jail. <laughs> oh, <beautiful. laughs> I love this. That's Come good. On. That's good. It's funny. It rhymes. Yeah, that's fine. No, it, it, it rhymes very... Yeah. Didn't want to publish because I heard it was shit. Which, I'm gonna look over his shoulder. Which one, dear? Me too. I'm looking. I did it for which one? Personal David. reasons David. because it led to what? Let him do. Let him do. The intense girl drawing ponies was a woman I uh, excuse me. Where the fuck is Lorna? College. Excuse me. I'm where we lost her. She walked out. She disappeared. Fuck. She was kind of sad, man. Where the fuck did she? Because I was wondering if she was dead. <laughs> But I thought it was a shitty God. poem, I still do, quite frankly. That's okay. Um, Apprehension. At a table in a cafe, an intense girl is drawing ponies. Immense wild horses with colossal teeth. 
It was also an artist comment on how hard it is to draw painty, uh, ponies and how nobody buys ponies. Well, that was what one of the artists said that Oregon Art Feet, you know, yesterday or that Mel Castle was on. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah. Actually, uh, Did you see that? Yeah, he's kind of cute. I like Mel. Yeah, I do too. Mel I like his, I'm whimsy. There's, there's Put the beds and the couches in there. And bed. it's uh, basically a love song so to Lorna. Oh, I love this one. I've, yeah, I've seen this one. I read this recently. So we love this one, one, though. Right. Should we Monster. Get, I, saw it, I saw it in one of the books. Actually, I can't hear it enough. It's Monsters. I don't know. I, oh, not the I'm, diamond. I might just go out That's there. Not the uh, enigmatic one. Okay. I'll probably go home and... On a bus or what? No, I might bike. And I'll give Joel, who I barely knew, we can publish three of mine, but I think I've made a lot of them. Lauren Alley has a fucking electronic device. I think it shows good taste. They think their dick is an electronic device, Lauren Alley. It's called Monsters. Is your dick an electronic device? Standing together, above ground, diarrhea below, like a picnic where we are huddled. Don't terribly don't on view, funny, funny. like a herringbone yeah. on recall that, to the void. We both said, you, you have done this with a yapping tongue. As slowly the pines dip over the barracuda, and love sits sucking on a car shed. Okay. Yeah. Right on. Right this is actually a serious poem. Yeah, I'll shut up. And I didn't uh, realize how serious until a bunch of guys had gone to AA or said something like that's pretty accurate, you know. I mean, I wrote it after I'd had uh, Delirium Crummins. I know Delirium Title is At the End of a Drunken Binge. I love this fucking Explosions of Twilight. Twinkle over the river. And sometimes my body shudders while my hands keep idly shaking. Loneliness whists all of my emotions far back inside bewildering memories. I remember meeting dead green men, survivors of a dream I woke up in and knew then that they were much, much more than mere hallucinations. Afterwards, I screamed for 13 hours in jail before being handcuffed to a bed. Now I have returned to normal brain and watched the sunset slash its vein. Let me see that song. It's a great fucking yeah, that's, poem. That's, that's, that's poetry. Poem, yeah. that's, that's called poetry. That's definitely. Not... And it's uh, basically a love song to Lorna.